this week you are marvelously helped of God in the name of Jesus Christ every helper that must appear in the name of Jesus before the weekend they already arrive let favor from Monday till Sunday let it follow you from Monday till Sunday let it follow you you will not die you will not cry in the name of Jesus anyone plotting evil for you like Haman their evil will come upon them I pray for you God who has shown many help God who has shown many mercy picking men from unbelievable pits and raising them to places of honor I call upon that God to surprise you in your finances no more dryness in your finances personally corporately no more dryness hear me if there is any one of you here who is owing whether as a company whether as an individual i don't care owing is owing anybody who is owing in the name of jesus christ i place an unction upon you come out of that debt now come out of that financial situation now in the name of jesus christ in the name of jesus one say in the name of jesus i decree and declare that the spirits and the forces responsible for my tears i declare judgment upon you now open your mouth and pray in the name of Jesus 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 Christ whatever is required for your rising in this season I call upon the God of heaven may he make it available for you may he make it available for you the wisdom needed let it be yours the help needed let it be yours the access needed let it be yours the influence needed let it be yours the grace needed let it be yours the courage needed let it be yours in the name of Jesus every force that keeps you down goes down for your sake every force attempting to keep you down goes down for your sake in the name of Jesus I prophesy over your life go forward go forward make progress go forward make progress I say it again go forward make progress shame and reproach is far from your life stagnation is far from your life let it be clear that the hand of God is upon you let it be clear that the wisdom of God is upon you let it be clear that the favor of God is upon you let it be clear that you have become Beulah and Hephzibah in the name of Jesus men will look at your life and they will learn God they will look at your life and they will desire to know him they will look at your life and turn away from evil they will look at your life and press for righteousness they will look at your life and love the things of God in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus say every legal access every legal access that the devil has over my life that the devil has over my life over the works of my hands over the works of my hands and over all connected to me and over all connected to me by the blood of the lamb, by the blood of the lamb I declare I declare that access is broken now go ahead and pray every legal access every legal access even the lawful captive shall be delivered Abraham, the God of the Bible, 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 the God of the Bible
name of Jesus. Shout it, say in the name of Jesus. I declare that I have no covenant with death. I have no covenant with the grave. Therefore, every altar that wants to administer death, may the Lord judge you right now. Open your mouth and pray. I have no covenant with death. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, many of you will be surprised as you see answers to this prayer begin to come into your life. Someone pray. Someone pray. Alabaka parakata sabrakatesh, rakata prakate balakate paros. Stewards of the manifold grace, businessman pray. Businesswoman, pray, pray, consistently pray, consistently travail, non pretentiously pray. Worshipper, pray, apostle, pray, prophet, pray, banker, pray, politician, pray. Legal practitioner pray. Shalakapat. Rabakata Pratakapalakata Baratos. Prayer with fastings. Pray. Prayer with dedications. Holding on to the altar. Generating power. Multiplying grace. Generating power. Apostolic power. Generating power. Multiplying grace. Activating manifold graces. Manifold graces, manifold graces until you become a sign and a wonder, a sign and a wonder until you embody favor, until you embody liftings, until you embody restoration. Firstborns. Rebuke the cost that is upon my God. Fire is going to fall here now. If you are a firstborn, every curse, not allowing you to move forward, making your younger ones to go ahead of you by the apostolic and the prophetic, be delivered now. Be delivered now. Bring them out. Every curse of the firstborn, first male, first female, first child, tying your destiny down and will not let you move forward. This is koinonia. Be delivered now. Bring them out. Bring them out. My God. Yes. I'm going to stretch my hands towards you. The power of God is going to come. You don't have to change the name physically, but from the realm of the spirit, any connection with any name, in the name of Jesus, those in front, I stretch my hands right now. Every altar that powers any name to work evil over you, in the name of Jesus, I declare right now at the count of three, let it be broken. One, two, three, break, break now. Ancestry. I'm saying it again. Name 
problems that came as a result of dedications done to idols, names that came as a result of covenants with the dead by the power that raised Christ from the dead, from the realm of the spirit, I break the power of those names now. I break the power of those names now. I break the power of those names now. I'm telling you, I'm just see fire rising in front. That's what I'm saying. I say it again. I break the power of those names now. The power of the, help that woman. The power of those names now. Please hear me. I'm praying for everybody. But then for those in front here, any exchange that has happened in the realm of the spirit, an exchange of your destiny, on account of Abakatos Ketekata, an exchange of Abare Ketos Kiata. Oh, I'm, I'm seeing exchanges happening. Let there be a restoration now. A restoration now. By fire, a restoration now. A restoration now. A restoration now. Release your destinies. Release your destinies. Every altar. Release your destinies now. Father, I receive your light. Go ahead and pray. I receive your light. High level spiritual illumination. The light that will transform superior thoughts superior ideas superior beliefs someone pray one minute sabalika parakatos kiata embra katabeleke paruska frenda beresko balash egra pakata barondos koprenda beleke pariata jabra kaparata kebereko tosiata light in the name of jesus light in the area of my finances light in the area of my spiritual life light in the area of my career light in the area of family and relationships light in the area of leaderships and my pursuit i receive light by the spirit light beyond the influence of culture light beyond the influence of my background light beyond the influence of my limitations someone pray you may be born in nazareth but you don't need to carry the mindset of the Nazarenes. You can carry the mindset of he that has come from above. Because he that comes from above is above all. You are a Nigerian. A proud one at that. But carry the mindset of a global giant. Carry the mindset of one who has come from above. Through Nigeria. Above. Through Nigeria. Above. Through Nigeria. Above through Africa, you are an agent of change, an agent restoring righteousness, an agent restoring order within your system. In the name of Jesus, one more minute, you are praying. One more time, say in the name of Jesus. I decree and declare by the power of the Holy Spirit that every walk of evil over my life, over my family, and all connected to me, I come against you in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Someone is praying. Someone is praying. Someone is praying.
in the name of Jesus father let me abound in this grace also I have received the grace for prayer let the grace for revelation rest upon me let me not just be a prayer person access to the mysteries of the kingdom someone is praying the grace for favor I'm tired of struggling in my organization struggling in ministry struggling financially compromising here and there because of money go ahead and pray tired of stuntedness gifted but limited because the grace for influence is not there the hear ye him anointing is not there someone pray I make progress but my progress is slow annoyingly slow Lord grant me the grace for speed someone pray pray passionately pray passionately pray passionately say in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus say it again in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus every closed door In the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus regardless your background I empower you to excel what your father could not do go ahead and do it what your mother could not do go ahead and do it the limitations that came with where you are coming from I cut it away from your life the discipline to be transformed receive the grace for it Wave your hands to Jesus. Every chain, every chain, shout it again. Say every chain, every chain, tying down my advancement, tying down my advancement, tying down my progress, tying down my progress by the power of the Holy Ghost. By the power of the Holy Ghost. Break now. Break now. Break now. Go ahead and pray. Every chain. Jesus, be broken, be broken, be broken, be broken, be broken, be broken. Be broken. In the name of Jesus.
in the name of Jesus every negative cloud over your head that is driving good things driving good people making you see good as evil and evil as good I decree and declare let that cloud be lifted from off your head every demonic force manipulating your reasoning always making you to get into trouble making bad decisions i cry unto god again in the name of jesus may your mind be under the influence of the spirit of god superior destiny advancing decisions ministry advancing decisions finance multiplying decisions grace multiplying decisions for as long as I live, I will not only see to it that you are vibrant spiritually and growing in influence. I believe in economic empowerment where God empowers the right hands. Once God has a heart that loves him and that you are able to use resources to better your life and to advance the cause of the kingdom, there are no restraints to him making wealth available. Are we together? By this prayer, for some of you, what you will be receiving is wisdom. By this prayer, what some of you will be receiving is access to the right resources. But then in the name of Jesus, I pray. The Bible says, believe. It says, and by a prophet, the Lord God brought Israel out of Egypt. And by a prophet, they were preserved. It says, believe the Lord your God, so shall you be established. Believe his prophets, so shall you prosper. Say, he suffered no man to do them wrong. He reproved kings for their sake, saying, Touch not my anointed and do my prophets no harm. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I am God's anointed. I am God's anointed. Therefore I declare. Therefore I declare. That every evil. That every evil. Against my life. Against my life. I curse you by the blood of the Lamb. Open your mouth and pray. Every evil. Every evil. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. There are people here. Look at me. Now, I'm not saying going abroad really means anything. But there are people, there is nothing in your life that has ever gone global. Not your products, not you. From your lineage, where you come from, nobody's head has ever been lifted to a global scale. At best, you are just recycled here. Let me push you by prophecy. In the name that is above all names, whatever has kept you down, for the name of Jesus and for being an effective witness, rise to a global scale. Rise to a global scale. In ministry, rise to a global scale. In business, rise to a global scale. May your products be global. May your services be global. In the name of Jesus. I'd like you to shout it from the depth of your heart. Say in the name of Jesus. I take authority over every hindrance. Over every hindrance. Stopping good things from coming into my life. Open your mouth and pray. Open your mouth and pray. Every hindrance. Men, systems, demonic forces, every hindrance, I come against you. I come against you. I come against you. Sabra Katabaka Toske Tepra, Keneke Toske Prande, Kepareko Tosko Yata, Rakata Prakatas Kata Prakatos Yata, every hindrance, every hindrance, 
in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Someone make it a desperate prayer. Someone make it a desperate cry. Someone make it a desperate prayer, a desperate cry. That your glory will be revealed through my life. Your power will be made manifest through my life. No distractions. You are praying, you are crying from a heart that is desperate, a heart that is sincere. The Lord is saying I should speak over you. I stand by the privilege of priesthood. Every family that the doors of marriage has been closed, let it be opened now. 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 Be open now. And in the name of Jesus, for every marriage right now that is epileptic, it looks as if it is crashing. The devil is joining the head of husband and wife and causing trouble. I declare peace to that storm. Peace to that storm. The wisdom to live in peace, let it be released upon you. In the name of Jesus. Koinonia, hear me. In the name of Jesus Christ, I decree and declare, when men say there is a casting down for you, let it be that there is a lifting up. Whether you are in Abuja, you are in Lagos, you are in Kano, whether you are in Nigeria, you are in UK, you are in US, regardless the location from tonight, may the blessing speak on you. May the blessing speak on you. With that blessing, let there be favor. With that blessing, let there be speed. With that blessing, let there be restoration. With that blessing, let there be restoration. I say it again, with that blessing, let there be restoration. In the name of Jesus. Two more prayers. Can I pray for your finances? Someone pray. In the name of Jesus. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. The mantle for my destiny. The mantle for my destiny. The mantle for my assignment. Rest upon me now. Open your mouth and pray. Open your mouth and pray. The grace assigned. The mantle assigned for your destiny. Let it rest upon you. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I pray for anyone here, you have struggled with prayer, it's something you can't tell anyone, but every time you go to pray, you are sleeping, you are snoring, you watch people pray, generating power, but the truth is that that grace is not yet on your life, I pray for you right now, in the name of Jesus, genuine authentic grace for prayer let it rest on you now let it rest on you now pastor let it rest on you now businessman let it rest on you now the grace to wake up and pray pray yourself to greatness I release that grace upon you now Number two, laziness over the study of scripture. There is no book you have brought that you've been able to read. You've not been able to read one book of the Bible. You are a sincere Christian. It's been a struggle. It's not by trying. Once that grace is not there, you will struggle. I pray for you. Passion for the word. May it consume you. May it consume you. May it consume you. May it consume you in the name of Jesus Christ. 
everything that left my life by demonic orchestrations I decree and declare hear the word of the Lord return back to my destiny open your mouth and prophesy restoration 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 Everything, everything, everything. Restore, restore, restore years, restore things, restore years, restore things. In the name of Jesus, decree and declare right now that everything young and old, there are some of you who are standing representing families, fraternities with the grave, the spirits of the dead. It says, oh dead, where is your sting? And oh grave, where is your victory? May that grace come upon you now, bringing liberty, bringing liberty, bringing liberty by the spirit of God. In the name of Jesus, who is the son of the living God, Marvelous God. Shalagabekatoska branda gabakosiata. Shavras kadina shalakosa pres kadina kaba. Engro dogo tobaratusiata. Now God is showing me something. I'm seeing something that looks like a shadow coming out of people, like physically shadow. These are spirits that have been moving in the bodies of people. In the name of Jesus, every familiar spirit. Every spirit that is not of God that has connected itself to your spirit manipulating your life and your destiny I declare that it leaves you right now I bring you deliverance right now by the power of the Holy Spirit 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 going to shout that name Jesus please hear me this is not just for individuals now there are many many families the Lord is showing me I'm seeing a man standing a very tall man and I'm seeing chains on your feet both of your feet they are under chains and the Lord is telling me that that man represents families it's not just an individual we're about to shout that name Jesus the moment that happens the power of God will come on individuals representing their various families. No matter where they are, some of them may not be here on ground, but the power of God is coming upon them. Are you ready to shout that name, Jesus? One, two, three, shout Jesus. I break those chains. I break those chains now. I break those chains now. I release families under demon under demonic captivities chains be broken 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 hallelujah anybody that is plotting evil against you whether kidnap or accident or sickness in the name of jesus let the earth open and swallow them let the earth open and swallow them in the name of jesus christ any charm any coven any satanic place in the name of Jesus that carries anything that belongs to you I declare that the power fails instantly 
let me pray for someone who is trusting God for a job in the name of Jesus may Ebenezer the helper of men surprise you in the name of Jesus every ministry here every business that is dead or dying everything in your hand that is dying you are holding something that is dying I give it life now let it come back to life now your business comes back to life your body comes back to life your ministry comes back to life in the name of Jesus Christ hallelujah whatever has taken the glory of the Lord upon your life for Samson it was Delilah that took that glory from him for Gideon something happened and he the least person the least in his father's house all those idolatry brought them to a place of subjugation whatever has taken the glory of God upon your life you used to be great you used to be anointed you used to be favored something happened and you just started drying up like a tree in the name of Jesus may the restorer restore you tonight I say it again may the restorer restore you tonight may the restorer restore you tonight hallelujah please hear me any door that was once open for good and whether by mistakes on your part by not understanding the laws that keep doors open or by some demonic thing that door closed whether doors of favor doors of relationship doors into the heart of great men I stand and call upon he that has the key of David the one that opened it and no man shut it and shut it and no man open it I speak to that door a fata be open be open be open the door to the hearts of kings be open the door to your destiny help us heart be open in the name of Jesus Christ I've taught you that who hates you does not matter but truly who likes you matters are we together let me pray for you you are not stagnated but you are not making constructive progress it will take you one year to do something that can be done in two months that is not the will of God I want to declare acceleration for you by the power that raised Christ from the dead some of you between now and the next two months you will do things you have not done in five years i prophesy you will do things you have not done in five years in the name of jesus christ hallelujah i'm hearing the lord is saying something to me i must obey him the lord is saying there are families where there are covenants that you and your children will never marry or enjoy marriage or marry and go back to your parents